finished, you're going to draw a unicorn. Yeah, we're going to draw a mom and baby unicorn. It's going to be a lot of fun, and we hope you're going to follow along. You need your drawing supplies. We're going to use markers, but you can use whatever you have at home or in the classroom. Yes. You also need some paper and... Something to color with. Yeah. All right, you ready to start? Yeah. We're using our Art for Kids Hub markers to draw with, and we also have multiple sheets of paper. We have a yeah. couple sheets just to protect our table so the marker doesn't soak through. Let's first draw the letter U for our mom's head, the mom unicorn's head. I'm going to draw a big U shape. You can draw it right here, go down, and back up. And you could also extend the side of the head up a little higher. There you go. And then we're going to draw a line to connect the top. Oh, yes. I love how big your little unicorn's head <laughs> is. <laughs> now let's draw the horn. We're going to draw an upside down letter V in the middle of the head. Up and down. And then we're going to draw the ears. We're going to draw another upside down V, but we're going to draw it smaller since this is for the ears. We'll go up, down, and then let's do the same thing on the other side. Okay, now let's also draw the inside of the ear. We're going to draw an even smaller upside down V on each side. And go up and down. Nice job. Ah, oh, perfect. Okay, now let's draw the hair. I'm going to draw a little curve that comes off to the side. We'll start up here on the right and come down to the left. And then let's draw the eyes. I'm going to draw a circle on the left and also a circle on the right. And let's color in the eyes. Oh, but before we do that, let's add a little highlight. So we could draw a smaller little circle in the top left and then color in the big circle, but leave that little circle white. What should we add next? Eyelashes. Eyelashes. I'm going to draw two little curves on each side of the eye. And anytime we go too fast, what can our art friends do? Pause the video. Yeah, if you need extra time. Oh, I love your little mom unicorn. Oh, and we could also add two little nostrils. Perfect. Okay, now let's draw the baby unicorn. And we're going to draw the mom holding the baby. So let's draw the smaller U shape for the baby's head. And I'm going to draw it touching the mom's cheek. And we're going to draw it kind of sideways too. Yes. And then let's repeat all of those same steps that we did for the unicorn, for the mom unicorn. We're going to draw a curve for the top of the head. And then let's draw the unicorn horn sticking out, an upside down V in the middle. And then we can draw the ears. I'm going to draw them small upside down Vs. Yes. And then let's draw the little bit of hair curving to the side. Then let's draw the eyes. I'm going to draw them kind of small. <laughs> <laughs> There you go, and color it in. And then what are we missing? The nostrils. Yeah, two little nostrils on the nose. <laughs> I love how cute your little baby is. Okay, now let's draw the baby's body, but we're going to draw it wrapped up in a blanket. So let's draw a sideways U shape that's kind of long. Look at that. And then I went all the way and touched the mom's chin too. Oh. <laughs> that's so cute. And then we're going to draw two little curves for the blanket that's wrapped around our baby. Yeah, you could add another one. Oh, perfect. Now let's draw our mom holding the baby. We're going to draw little hands right here. I'm going to draw a small letter U. Yes, and then let's draw another one for the other hand over here. Yeah, okay, now let's draw the body for our mom. I'm going to draw a little line coming down from the side of her head right here on, yeah. And then we're going to draw two lines coming down from the hands. So we could draw one coming down there and then, yeah. And then let's connect them at the bottom. Okay, what should we draw next down here? The legs. The legs. And let's also draw the feet. We're going to draw two letter U's that are kind of tall for each leg. Yeah, and then let's draw the feet. We're going to draw two lines at the bottom. What are our unicorns missing? The hair and the tail. Yeah, let's add more hair. We're going to draw an S curve. Watch, we're going to curve one way down, and then we're going to curve the other way. Yes. Good job. And yeah, there you can connect it. Let's draw a little zigzag coming in. 
And then let's draw another zigzag coming out. And then let's draw a big curve coming into our mom's cheek. Let's also give her a tail down here. We'll draw another S curve. We'll curve up, down, and then back up. Oh. <laughs> it's waving in the wind. It <laughs> looks really pretty. Okay, and then here we're gonna start at the end and we're gonna draw a big, just curve going one way. Or you could follow it. Yeah, and I like that it's extra long too. Okay, let's add hair for the baby. We're gonna repeat the same steps over here, but for the baby. So we're gonna draw a little smaller. We'll curve, we'll draw an S curve so it goes both ways. Yes, and then we're gonna draw a little zigzag in, out, and then curve back in, and I'm gonna connect to the mom's hand. Oh, <laughs> we, we did it. We finished drawing our little unicorn family. Yes. The mom and the baby. Yeah. Except we're not completely done. We still need a color. Yes, my favorite part. We're using our Art for Kids Hub crayons. These are gel crayons and yeah. they're really fun to use. We're going to put them off to the side and pick our colors. Yeah. These are the colors that we picked out. We got blue, yellow, pink. What's this color? Purple. Purple. And then and we also. Dark purple. And dark purple and kind of a pink purple. Yeah. I really like these colors. And our art friends don't have to use the same colors if they don't want to. They can use whatever colors they want. And do our art friends have to use the same crayons that we're using? No. No, you can use whatever you have at home. You could use markers or even colored pencils or even a different type of crayon. Yeah. All right, let's first use the yellow crayon and we just have this set, so we're going to share. Yeah. I'm gonna color the first layer on our unicorn's hair. I'm gonna color just a little corner right here. I'm also going to color right here, the top of our mom's hair. And also, oh, let's add a stripe of yellow on the very top of the horn. Oh, I'm gonna repeat the same colors on the baby too. So the top is yellow Yeah. on the front hair and also the side hair. And do you want to do the same thing? Yeah. Oh, you remembered to color the tail. I need to do that too. <laughs> I'm gonna color the top of the tail with a yellow stripe. Okay, now we're ready to switch to our next color. Let's use pink. I'm gonna color the top of, or the middle of the horn then let's color the inside of the ears and also the cheeks. We gotta add little pink cheeks, huh? Yeah. And let's do the same on the baby. I'm gonna color the horn, also the middle of the hair, ooh, and the ears. I'm gonna color all of the ears. <laughs> and then we can also add a little stripe on the tail and also the hair. Oh, I forgot. We got the hair up here too. And if we're going too fast, remember to pause the video. You can even rewind the video if you need a lot of extra time. Yeah. There we go. Oh, and right here too. There's so many places to color pink. Yeah. Do you want to do the same? Yes. Nice job. Now let's switch to our purple crayon and we'll color the bottom of the horn, the bottom of the hair on the front and then also the back hair or the side hair. And let's do the same thing for the baby, the horn, this hair, and also the tail. The tail. All right, you ready to color? Yeah. Now what color should we use? The blue. The blue. Okay, let's use this for the hands and also the mom's feet. The little hooves down here at the bottom. Yeah. There we go. All right, your turn. Okay. You forgot to color the cheeks <laughs> on your mom. <laughs> there you go. Two One, cheeks. Two cheeks. You want to do the babies too? Three cheeks. Four cheeks. <laughs> Wait, that's forehead. You colored Dude, the that's forehead. A forehead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now let's switch to our last color, and we're gonna use this kind of dark purple, kind of a red color too. Yeah. We're gonna color the blanket for our baby. All right, your turn. Let's add one more detail. We're gonna add a little X and a plus for stars. Maybe our mama unicorn is putting the baby to sleep and it's nighttime. Yeah. Or this could be magical stars. Magical stars, yeah. Because <laughs> our unicorn's magical too. <laughs> <laughs> 
Do you want to add stars? Yeah. Now you guys could add even more things to the background. You could change it. You could add, oh, maybe a sun, or you could even draw other unicorns. Yeah. Oh, I like that you're even drawing actual stars. Oh, you're doing such a great job. How old are you? Six. Six. You're awesome. And you could be super proud of your drawing. I love that our two drawings don't look exactly the same. Yeah. That's okay, right? Because the most important thing is? To have fun and practice. Yes, have fun and practice. Do you want to add a few more stars? Yeah. Olivia, give me five. We did it. We finished drawing and coloring our mom and baby unicorn, and I love your drawing the most. Thank you. I like yours too. Oh, thanks. And I especially love drawing and coloring with you. You can pause the video right now to match our same coloring or to even add more things to your drawing. We hope you have fun drawing unicorn with us. We do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.